Hello friends, welcome to Unreal Engine video tutorial series. In this video tutorial, I would like to discuss how to add third person character to Unreal project. We understand how to add third person character to blank project in Unreal Engine guys, step by step. So let's get started. I double click on Unreal Engine icon available at the desktop. You can see Unreal project browser window got open. Under project categories, I select games. Under project templates, I select blank, project type blueprint, target platform desktop, quality preset maximum, I am not adding starter content, real time ray tracing disabled, project location desktop, project name I give, TPS project and then I click on create. That creates a project with the name TPS project. You can see TPS project is open in the Unreal editor. I am going to create a new level, I save file say new level in new level templates i select basic template and then i say create that creates a new level with the name untitled i am going to save this level i say file save current level as i right click on the content folder say new folder name it as levels in the levels folder i save the level with the name level 1 and then i say save guys if i click on the play button you see we don't have third person character in this level but still we can look around using the mouse we can press w key to move forward s key to move backward a key to move left d key to move right i press the escape key to come out of the play mode as i told i want to add third person character to my project i want to make third person character to be visible in my project levels so for that what i have to do is i have to add third person feature pack i go to content drawer click on add button then i go to add feature or content packs to the project i click on this option as my project is of type blueprint i select here blueprint and then i select third person feature pack and you can see it is telling the third person pack features a playable character where the camera is positioned behind and slightly above the character guys i click on add to project you can see it has added the content related to third person and we have here blueprints in that we have third person character if i double click on it it will open in the blueprint editor in the viewport we can see the visuals of our uh, third person character here we have the character and we have the camera also and it has the code to control the character here i close it and we have bp underscore third person game mode so this game mode contains the default pawn to spawn. If I double click on it, you can see here default pawn class is set to BP underscore third person character guys. Default pawn class is set to BP underscore third person character. Let me close it. I close this also. I close this also. If I click on the play button, still we don't see third person character added. I stop it. To make third person character visible in all the levels. We go to edit, we go to project settings, go to maps and modes. Here we have default game mode. We change the default game mode from game mode base to BP underscore third person game mode. So when we click on the play button, Unreal Engine goes to BP underscore third person game mode. Okay, let me close this. It goes to third person folder, blueprints folder. We have BP underscore third person game mode. In that it looks for default pawn class okay default pawn class is set to bp underscore third person character so it just makes bp underscore third person character to be spawned in the level if i click on the play button now you should see our character added to the level guys and you can see we can look around press the w key to move forward s key to move backward a key to move left D key to move right. If I press the spacebar key, the character jumps. You can use the mouse to look around. So that is how you can add the third person character to our project guys. If I press the escape key, we come out of the play mode and we can define exactly where the third person character should spawn. For example, I want the third person character always should get spawned in this place. So for that, we take help of player start actor I drag and drop the player start actor in this place 
next time when I click on the play button you can see our third person character gets spawned in that place I stop playing for example if I say let's take I just go back let's say I want the third person character to spawn this side okay now if I click on the play button our third person character gets spawned in this place play you can see now we are at the edge right so that is how you can add third person character and make it spawn in a specific location using the player start actor guys now what happens whatever levels we create in all the levels the third person character is spawned guys if I save file I just say save current level I create one more level I say file say new level I select basic and say create I am going to save this level file save current level as in the levels folder I save the level with the name level 2 and then I say save I drag the player start here if I click on the play button you can see here also we have third person character spawned right I press the escape key to come out so in every level we see third person character getting spawned guys that's it guys for this video tutorial I hope you guys have clearly understood how to add third person character to Unreal project I suggest you people to try it yourself if you like this video hit the like button and share with your friends so that everyone will get benefited for more benefits and be update do not forget to subscribe to our youtube channel keep learning keep gaming keep sharing thank you guys thank you very much see you in the next tutorial Thank <laughs> you.